Happy Halloween! Trick or treat, there. What? I'm still in high school. Raisin? Seriously? Raisin? Special spooky episode of Video 1980. Stay tuned, we got some great stuff. Quest for the Unknown. Hauntings. Alien abduction. Artificial intelligence. Strange rituals. Cryptozoology. Unexplained phenomenon. All explained on Quest for the Unknown. Weekdays at 4 on Channel 6. Hey there, welcome back to a special Halloween episode of Video 1980. This is my favorite time of the year there, because it brings back all the memories of when I was a kid in the 80s there, with all the masks and the Halloween and the decorations there, and most importantly, the trick-or-treating. Man, I was trick-or-treating until I was like 20 years old, because... Uh, <laughs> You know, I was still in high school at the time there, but, you know, I didn't care. Free candy for me. And, uh, you know, some people would give you the candy and the other people would give you fruit and stuff like that there. I don't understand that. The other day, some guy tried to give me some raisins. Boy. Anyway, one of my favorite things is the smell of candy. Oh yeah, that just, oh boy, that brings me back there. The smell of the candy there and the wax paper. One of my favorite candies was this pixie stick here. Because you know, all the cool kids would tell you to snort it. And you know, oh yeah, you'll get high over the pixie sticks there. But don't do that, it, it just burns really badly. And you might have to go to the doctor there. Oh boy, man, I might have to start eating this right now. But look at all this. Oh boy. The classics. Smarties right there. You can also crush these up and snort them too, but you know, same thing. Oh yeah, the Jolly Ranchers. Those were some of my favorites. They really took my feelings out there. All of these take some feelings out. Mary Jane there. I don't know, I think that's some sort of subliminal thing to get kids, uh, you know, going down the wrong road. Hey, you know, the Pez there for the uh, Space 1999 Pez dispenser there. Let's put that in there. Now he's not hungry anymore, there. Oh, so, you know, you got your, like, your Tootsie Rolls there, and you know, I don't know, Butterfinger. Those are pretty good fun size there. Uh, let's see there. Oh yeah. Sugar daddies. These are pretty good. You can chew on these, but uh, you know, watch out for your feelings yet again. Oh, let's see what else we got here. Oh yeah. Pop Rocks. Candy plus carbon dioxide equals fun until you die. I've seen it happen. Don't do it. Oh, what else we got here? Oh, yeah. All kinds of 
some of this stuff here. Oh, yeah. Check this out. I always like these because, you know, hey, the old ring pop there. Put it on there and you'll be uh, styling. And it doesn't taste very good, but, you know, hey, it looks pretty cool. And you've got, uh, you know, jewelry plus candy. It was fun. One of the old classics there, you know, the old Dum Dums day. That one's like berry. Let me get another one here. Strawberry shortcake. Where's the butterscotch? Damn it. Butterscotch. There it is. Mine. You can't have it. Butterscotch. So, you know. Oh boy, look at all this. This is great stuff here. I'm going to go to town on this stuff, you know, in about an hour. So, you know, you, when you get home from trick-or-treating, you, you dump out all your candy there and you fight over it. You know, kind of deathmatch style with your little sister. And she'd always win. But, you know, there'd always be plenty of candy left there. Some other candy. You know, you got your Reese's Pieces there. For the ETs that like to go trick or treating. Old school, you know, good and plenties because they're good and apparently there's a lot of them. Oh, the milk duds. I think the gremlins like the milk duds there. They're pretty good. And, you know, dots for the dot man. Oh, yeah. Big leg Drew there for the, uh, you know, the redneck kids. So, you know, get them started early, you know what I'm talking about there. One of the worst candies ever to come about are these dang Necco thingies. These things taste like plastic, I don't know, 10-year-old cardboard. Anyone giving these out should be shot. So, you know... You'd go trick or treating there, and occasionally, you know, you'd have to egg somebody's house for, for having bad candy. Case in point. But, uh, you know, basically it's a lot of fun. You kids don't do it much these days. I don't know, some kids like going to the mall there for trick or treating. I used to work at the mall. That's a stupid way to trick or treat. I tell you. Well, one thing I've got to show you guys here. A little bit of uh, 80s nostalgia there is uh, a little something I like to uh, show you. Let's see if I get it fired up here. Oh uh, yeah. Gather round and watch. Watch the Check it out. Watch. Oh, I gotta put the mask on there. There we go.
I'm taking your pumpkin raisin, give up. <laughs>